Good morning. Welcome to the channel. Rick and I, Ross Lake Township, fishing a lake we fished a few times before. It's been uh, it's been good to us. Hopefully, we can figure something out here. Thanks so much for joining. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll get started here in a minute. Shit. He picked that up on the fall. There one just hitting the weeds right there. There's a fish. He's not huge, but he'll probably measure. small. Rick scores first with the jig 1.03. 1 1.03. 1 I guess we're weighing fish under a pound and a half today. <laughs> He ain't big. He keeps though. him on the deep, uh, deeper rocks, it's uh, 15 or so, 12 to 15 feet out here. The, the lake is uh, very tannic water. The weeds don't grow much deeper than about 3 feet, 4 feet. So we like to fish the little offshore rock spots and uh, gravel spots up next to the weeds. But we uh, missed a couple of fish in the pads earlier started fishing a point with some pads to kind of work towards this rocks but now we're out on the rocks caught one here That's how you eat the frog right there. But he ain't very big. smallest fish 1.03 caught him on a jig again that's fish number four we need one more for our uh, five fish goal A 
Google guys. That's fish number five. That's goal number one. Dark colored fish in this lake. Total 7.34. Oh man. That's brutal. 7.34. Yep. If it's a bass, not giant, but nice. No. It's a solid two and a half, I think. Fish number, uh, call number one, 2.60. Real pretty fish. 2.60, pretty one. Dark colors, 8.90, 8.90. He's not giant, but hooked in the corner of the mouth, I guess. First cast with the creature bait. Come on, honey. Sorry about that, buddy. There we go, there's another call, 1.87, 1.87, 9.74, 9.74, all right, caught him on a uh, weedless um, swing head, throwing it up in the, in the sh got a Christie critter on there, black with the red speckles in it. Just threw it in there, laid it on the bottom, and he picked it off the bottom before I even started working it. That was, I thought that was gonna be a damn good one. Just tore the sh bait. And that's because this is a f yum bait. They're so soft. I I don't even like using them. I'm never buying another yum. Yeah, threw that in there and just... Just like that. Another one. Throw it in there and let it sit on the bottom, and then they pick it up. That's a better one. Yeah. Hmm. Baza. I'll go over this way that time. But the first time I was straight in there. Got one? You got me all excited.
excited there. It's a two pounder. Two point seven nine, two point seven nine on the uh, swing head. I don't even know what brand this is. Uh, 11.08 now, 11. .08. I don't even know what brand this is, but it's a, it's like a weedless oh, swing head. You can slither it through the weeds nice. It's got a little extra action on it. And I'm throwing a Christie critter on there from Young. Just throwing it out there, laying it on the bottom when I pick up the slack, the fish are on there. So I'm not even working it. That's two casts in a row with that. First two casts I made with it. It's either a good one or he's really got a lot of salad hanging on him. Nice one. Finally, I catch a decent fish. He was in there. Dandy. That's a three pounder. Man, he's well fed. Look at the belly on him. They're all well fed in this lake. It's a 328, 328. Look at the color on those. They're so dark. 3.28. Nice fish. He caught that on a plastic worm. It's got that Tequila Sunrise 10 inch power worm on there. That's a 12.72. 12.72. We are uh, well on our way to 13 now, all of a sudden. Yeah, it looks like it. I don't feel it though. <clears throat> I think that's a pike. Oh, it's a nice, it's a nice bass. my jig up and was swimming with it. I, I was trying to feel the bottom and he was swimming under the boat and then all of a sudden I realized my line was moving. And <laughs> it's gonna take us to 13. I might, I might get 15 out of this guy. Here we go, rock jig fish, 4.16, 4.16, beauty, 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 beauty. Dobbins rock jig, 15.01, 15.01, all right, so we made our third, our second goal of 13 pounds and we made our unofficial main goal of 15 pounds, so 15.01, gotta love that. There's another fish. <laughs> Not giant. I think he'll call though. A couple of pounds.
pounds anyhow. We everything we've got's over two, so I don't know. He might not go. There we go, another call. 2.62, 2.62. That's on the rock jig again. That fish is uh, takes us up to 15.47. 15.47. So we were catching fish shallow and about three feet on cabbage and pad mix and then there was a rock hump off that off that uh, break line uh, in about six feet drops off into like 12 14 Cat, caught both these last two fish right on top of that rock hump in about six feet six and a half feet Feels like a decent one. Not giant, but feels decent. It's a nice bass. Yeah. that's gonna call it will for sure 3.30 on a Carolina rig for God's sakes Carolina rig 3.30 takes up to 16.18 16.18 another nice call only got you know like an hour left to go here Fishing a sand point comes way out into the lake. It's only about eight feet deep on top or less. Pure sand. That sucker was sitting out on the middle of that thing. Carolina rig with a yum spine craw on it. Uncle Frank special. I was so shocked. Caught something on a Carolina rig and it was a three pounder. Let's get one more. I can really cast that thing. <laughs> and as soon as I started reeling, I felt the end goal. Must have uh, hit it on the on the fall. It kind of runs, kind of runs this way. I was casting over the top of it. feel rock out here on this spot a lot more than over here. This second raised spot's got a bunch of gravel on it, I think. There's another one. There he is. Yep, right out there. get rid of that other two pounder <laughs> I 
guess we're over on this side. <laughs> No. But it's still a nice fish. Might be over that two and a half. Though. Still a nice fish. Shoot! I wanted a three pounder. Not going to be a three pounder. Over there, Rick. Out oh, that way. The boat swung around. Call on the Carolina rig 2.71, 2.71. That's the small fish still. Uh, 16.27, 16.27. See if you cast. There you go. That's a good one, huh? I don't know that he's going to call. It's not that great. I don't think so. He was swimming towards the boat. He's our three pounder. He might be four now that I love him. He's pretty wide. Hey. Okay. Damn, nice one. Yeah, that's a call for sure. I got a little excited there, eh? Cussed like a sailor. Oh yeah, beauty. It's a nice call for Rick. 3.63, 3.63. Can we see him here? Nice fish, 3.63, caught him on a plastic worm. He's using the old, uh, Max Scent now again. 17.19. I think we were 16 before, huh? 17.19. Awesome. All right. So Ross Lake Township. Pretty good day today for Rick and I. We uh, caught fish shallow. We caught fish, uh, I wouldn't say deep, but on offshore structure. I mean, the weeds in this lake are only like three, maybe four feet deep. So deep rocks and gravel seven feet deep we did try a couple of deeper spots didn't get anything going over there but uh, found uh, some nice fish in the uh, cabbage pad mix and then found some nice fish at the end here on a little gravel point so we uh, we did 17.19 uh, which I I guess coming into it I would have been happy with that I wasn't really sure what to expect I was hoping to make 15 and we did so the day is a, a success for us so we'll definitely hit the lake again we really enjoy this lake uh, it's fun to get over here at least uh, you know, one time a year to see how we can do it so we want to thank you so much for joining don't forget to like and subscribe and until next time for rick in the back my name is mark this is man on a mission fishing we'll see you on the water next time